Ranking Almost Every Map Projection, Episode 3. And today we have the Oblique Mercator Projection. So just like the Transverse Mercator and the Regular Mercator Projection, this is a conformal cylindrical map projection. And the oblique mercator is set apart from the normal and transverse mercator projection because it essentially acts as in between those two projections where the cylinder is put at an angle on the earth. And this can create multiple different versions of the oblique mercator, such as this one, which makes South America the dominant force at the bottom of our world. This one, which uncomfortably stretches Africa out. And this one, which is probably the best out of the ones we've seen, but still, it looks very weird. And much like the Transverse Mercator, it has only a specific niche use. But unlike the Transverse Mercator, it does not have a coordinate system based off of it. Well, mainly small-scale mapping of countries that are at an angle. However, this is really the only use, and as you can see on the map, it gets extremely distorted the farther away you get from the center. And so I'm going to rank this oblique mercator as an F. It just doesn't look that great and doesn't really have a use. 